This is a humidifier. I wanted to take it apart, and I just screwed off the bottom, so this piece comes off, and then this can slide off easily. There's the inside. Then if you need to get it off, you flip it over, and I already took the screws out, so it's hard doing it easily. And then that's the inside. There's this comes off, and this can move around. Uh, right here is some wax, actually. You can just break that off. It's like wax for some type of glue. There's, uh, if you look in between these two blue things, there are all of them four. One, two, three, and then there's one over here, right here. That's the fourth resistor, so there are four resistors in there. Um, this little thingy right here that looks like a gas tube is actually a, a fuse. So if that, you can actually pop it out if you remove these, but if I'm not going to do that. So if you pop this fuse, you plug it in and you turn it on, it won't work. Because the fuse, if it gets overloaded, it just goes doink. And then it sounds, probably like a popping sound. Uh, I'm going to try to remove this real quick. I've seen one of these before. But I've never actually known what they are. I'm going to cut off these little wires right here and right here. I don't know why they're blue and red, but the red ones are both, if you look in between there, both of the red ones are like, so uh, I snip these off and if you look there, Right down in there, there's some uh, aluminum or something. And then the blue ones are the same. I thought they were copper. Oh yeah, the blue ones are copper. I think this is what spun the air around. Let me see if, oh yeah. Yeah, if I flip it back over, that's where that is. So then it's actually coming out here. So then it goes, the water goes down into this, and then it gets blown around and out the top. So this actually blows the air around. That's really smart. And as you can see, that's what that whirring sound is when it's spinning. And I don't know what that is. It looks like solder or something. And then this is probably another transformer. Okay, I'm gonna try out oh, there's two screws down there, so I'm gonna screw oh that's the wrong screw. Uh yeah. There we go. So uh here's the little water wheel thingy and here and there are Here's a little fun fact about motors, is if you spin them yourself, they actually put out electricity. it off there so here's the actual circuit board I will I'm gonna take this circuit board off of from that other piece so it'll just be each piece Now I'm going to cut 
the power here. Let's see here. I think the red one's copper. No, the black one's copper. Actually, they're both copper, I think. And here's the circuit board. I can move these around. There's this little wire here. I think that's supposed to extend it and shorten the power. So I'm going to actually pull this out now. Here is the... So if I were to plug it in while all of this was on and I took this off, it wouldn't have worked because this is the... Um, I forget what this is called, but it's the fuse. The fuse. Uh, so there are these little pieces of metal folded over to keep it in there for not more, for, like sliding on or sliding around. Since this is a humidifier, uh, that would have been on. That would have been off. So then you can turn it on and all the way on, or like all the way off, and then. That's what that is, so I'm going to try to cut all the power sources off, or the wires off. It seems to me, if I look really close, yeah, there's, there's copper, both are copper. This, this other one is copper too. So then, there's a lot of copper sometimes, and let's see if it turns it on. No, it does not. So, I think when it goes click, I think it's uh, pushing two pieces of metal together or copper. If I can't, I might move on to the next thing. There we go. Those actually can turn. This can go whole 360 now. So. So this is can move, and I got it off. So uh, I think this is the thing that made it go tick. Um, so there's that. I'm gonna move on to these little extra wires here. I'll just snip these off real quick. Oh wow! So they're two white, two black, two red, and two yellow. The yellow ones are metal, the red ones are metal, or like steel, or aluminum, I mean. This one's copper, and this one's copper. So, I'm going to try to pull these off, but first, you need to get this little thingy off here. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. So... Two blue. There's all the other colors. And that's basically what. But they just came to an end or something. You can't seem to pull them off. So I think that is it. Hope you liked the video.